85% of Canadians do believe that that is an important right to have, and especially one in legislation, um, rallying Canadians to go out to their MPs and go out in their communities and put pressure on our politicians to implement this legislation. And I, I, you know, I feel like a lot of people don't realize that we don't have these rights, and I, they're really important. So it was really great to have her out too. Mm. Yeah, I was really shocked by that. That as Canadians, we do not have environmental rights. We don't have the right to clean water. That's not a human. And in other countries, they do have the right to clean water and clean air. Uh, she gave Norway as an example, mm -hmm. really good examples that is instituted and, and and has these rights there and these laws. And uh, I was just shocked um, that. And we see that also. You know, often on One Spirit Whispers, we do talk about uh, Indigenous communities that don't have access to clean water, uh, that are living in poor, poor conditions, living conditions, and, you know, uh, they, you know, I found out the other day that this is not even a right here in Canada, which is shocking because I feel that there's often an impression given about Canada that we're, we're super progressive and we're really environmentally friendly and everything is, you know, in good shape, you know, not true, <laughs> not true at all. And um, just a couple weeks ago, that report came out about Canada's uh, changing um, climate. And uh, I actually want to pull that up a little bit later. I'll bring that up and we'll read that about how um, uh, Canada is really warming at twice the rate um, as, for, you know, compared to other countries. So I'll find that a little bit later and we'll read through that together. 